Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we just got the new quality of life update and I actually joined the game to train my horses and it suddenly shut down for an update so I'm just now recording this like literally like three minutes after it updated and with the quality of life update we get a new farm shed to spawn your horse at your ranch which I think is so cool and we also get a new farm wash rack which means you can bathe your horse at your ranch and you get it we get a new horse gender potion so you can change your horse's gender and uh horse agendas are randomized every 15 minutes so i'm assuming that means like that the horses that are for sale their genders will change every 15 minutes so that's pretty cool so if you're looking for a certain gender it won't take as long to get the one that you're looking for and I think this is a pretty cool update, and I like that you have the option to allow your horse to spawn at your ranch, and I think that the ranch is going to become more functional in the future, which I think will be really cool for role plays. So if you want to get the new items, you go to farm, and I just went to all, and here is the shed. It costs $5,000, and it makes it so that your horse will spawn at your ranch, so it won't spawn at the stable anymore. And then we also have the wash rack, which costs $3,000 or quins, whatever we want to call them. And it allows you to wash your horse. So I just found this thing and I don't know what it is. I think it's new. I don't know what this is for. So I was going to the full center to see if that was where the potion was going to be. And this thing, is it like a little water tower or something? is right next to this bridge next to like the little town hall thing so it doesn't like do anything that i can see here but um i don't know is this new you guys so it took a little while and if you go to the witch's hut which if you already if you don't already know this is what it looks like and um this is where it is it's just right here i figured i'd check the witch's hut because i was like oh well, it's a potion, so it kind of would make sense. And don't mind how I haven't even gotten the dream catcher thing yet, um, but that's okay. So this is it. It's 150 diamonds, which is pretty expensive, but kind of makes sense because it's um, it gives you the opportunity to change your horse's gender. So it is expensive, but if you did really want a certain horse to be a mare or a stallion, it's an option, you know. So I guess the horses refresh every couple minutes. So um the arabian the clydesdale and the quarter horse aren't here right now so i am assuming that all of these will go away and then the arabian the quarter horse and the clydesdale will um cycle through so i guess it's like every 15 minutes you get new horses and new genders okay so a lot of people in the server are chatting about how they think that there's going to be like brand new horses but it just swaps the gender and what i thought it was gonna okay actually wait i think the arabian's over here now okay so i guess they didn't remove them from the game i didn't think that they would because they're just like i don't think that they would remove any of these horses from the game but it switches their gender and it makes the um it gives you new horses so yeah that's what that does and um that with this system of refreshing it even though it's not as convenient as them all being out at the same time it will give them more space to add new horses comment down below what you guys think about this update i think it's pretty cool and i think that they added some good stuff i think that the whole like refreshing system with the horses is going to take some of getting used to but i think it was a cool update um anyway that's it for today's video and i'll see you guys next time bye